28 years ago, my daughter was two years old, um, and I was about to get married. And she was a Christian, so I immediately went to church. My, my sister actually introduced me to her, and uh, there I, I started going to church on Sundays and, and got baptized there, and, and I was saved. But I, I believed some things about Jesus and God. I, I didn't really make the conversion. I didn't turn my will and my life over to God, um, which is what you have to do to be a Christian. <laughs> so it was just pretty much a superficial, uh, you know, go to church on Sunday. And we still carried on with our drinking and and... You know, I, I was pretty much living a double life, and it was, you know, I come to realize many years later how how fake it was. It wasn't real. Going through a 10-year meth addiction, I uh, eventually had enough consequences to get into recovery, and the recovery process involves God, and uh, somewhere in that process, I, I started going to church again at a different church. For a couple of years, and uh, started developing this personal relationship with God through uh, the twelve-step program I was in, and uh, and miraculously He lifted the obsession to use um, drugs from me, and and that that was when it solidified it in my heart that this this stuff is real. Two years later, I met my wife. So we decided we were going to go find a church that would be ours. And uh, we went to four or five different churches before we came here. And uh, one sermon from Pastor Dave, and, and I, I looked at her, she looked at me, and I said, this is our church. <laughs> and, and it still is. I, I love this church. Recovery changed everything. It brought me closer to God um, and made God real to me. And then coming to church helped me develop that personal relationship with him. He's done so many miraculous things in my life, it's incredible. When it's real, it changes you. And I didn't change. This time it's real, and I, he has changed me.